Hello, hello all YouTube viewers. My name is Dennis Ramsey, world famous folk artist. I live in the small town of Kempville. We have about 8,000 people that live here. Anyhow, I want to start a friendly folk art society. Anyhow, it would be free to join, no cost. The only thing you'd have to pay for is your postage of your letters. But beyond that, there would be no cost. The idea of starting a folk art society is to make it more arts friendly in the town of Kempful. That's the idea of it. Also, it would be open to fine artists and abstract artists also. They would be welcome to join also. Anyhow, so I do folk art painting and abstract art painting. I sell my paintings for $100 each, up to $200 each. If you ever want an abstract art painting or a folk art painting, you can call me at 902-365-5044. Or you can visit me at 27 Canaan, C-A-N-A-A-N Avenue, Apartment B, Kempful, Yellow House, White Trim. Anyhow, or you can write me a letter. It's Dennis Ramsey, D-E-N-N-I-S-R-A-M-S-A-Y, 27 Canaan, C-A-N-A-A-N Avenue, Apartment B, Kempful, K-E-N-T, V-I-L-L-E, Nova Scotia, N-O-V-A-S-C-O-T-I-A, postal code is B4N2A7, Canada, C-A-N-A-D-A. Anyhow, the idea of starting a folk art society is to make it more arts friendly in the town of Kempful. I know I suffered four years of bullying and discrimination, and it was very painful, very hurtful, and it was mean-spirited. It was mean-spirited driven. These people that did that to me probably don't like themselves because if they can go after the yard sailors and the nickel and dime guy, the starving folk artist, they would probably pick on anybody that's vulnerable or doesn't have the money to fight back. Anyhow, the moral of my story is to start a folk art society where it's more arts friendly in the town of Kempville. Like I said before, I'm not allowed out between Monday to Friday to do any folk art displays, or I suffer a $50 fine, which I think is crazy. You know, it's dumbfounded. Because in a free country like Canada, a folk artist can only do folk art displays on Saturdays and Sundays, and Monday to Friday I gotta stay in the house. I can't sell my paintings between Monday to Friday outdoors by my residence. Anyhow, let's start an arts-friendly society where it's friendly to fine artists, folk artists, and abstract artists. We'll call it the Dennis Ramsey Art Society, or we could call it the Dennis Ramsey Folk Art Society. It'll be free to join. Like I said, there's going to be no charge. Um, it's got to be free. Because most artists are starving and got no money anyhow. So being realistically, you can't charge people money when they don't have it. So the idea of it is for us to communicate through letter writing and phone calls and to start this arts friendly society in the town of Kempful. And the reason my motivation is behind this is because I suffered four years of bullying and discrimination and it was very painful, very hurtful and uh, like I said before, it was very mean-spirited driven by the former mayor, the former deputy mayor and the whole town council. I had one great big splinter group after me and they harassed me for four years straight. They wouldn't even let up on me or give me a break. So. What I'm saying is, when you got like 12 people against you, how can a man win, right? 
the numbers outnumbered. I had, and they were powerful people. I had the mayor, the deputy mayor, and the whole town council against me. Then to put, you know, more insult to injury, I had the head administrator against me and his co-workers. So probably the body count there, I had about 20 people against me just because I painted folk art paintings and I sold them during the weekdays, three or four days during the week. So that was the reason they went after me. And they got their way in the end. They made this yard sale bylaw. And I'm not allowed out Monday to Friday to do any folk art displays. I'm only allowed out on Saturdays and Sundays. So in a sense, you know, in a sense they won. But I don't see how they feel great about that kind of a victory because all the yard sailors had to suffer also because of their victory. Meaning the yard sailors are only allowed out on Saturdays and Sundays. And if they go out between Monday to Friday, they also suffer a fine of $50. So what makes me kind of angry is that they're picking on the poor peoples of Kempful and Kings County. And this problem here affects a few thousand people. Yes, they got their own way with Dennis Ramsey. They stopped my folk art displays between Monday to Friday. They won that, no doubt about it. But what they didn't gain is the thousands of people that they hurt, like the yard sailors in general. That really hurt them. So in a sense, all they've accomplished is hurting five or six thousand different peoples. That's all they've accomplished in the end. Um, if you call that a victory, I'd call it actually um, discrimination and bullying. That's what I would call it. And I'd also call it being mean and evil, to be honest. You know, to be honest. Anyhow, getting back to the Folk Art Society, or Art Society, whichever you guys want, Let's start at Kempful Art Society, where it's friendly to fine artists, folk artists, and abstract artists. Like I said, there'll be no charge to be a member. The only thing you'll have to pay for is your postage, when your communication with the members in the group. Anyhow, so we can do a lot of it by telephone or the internet, or also by letter writing. Anyhow, you can call me at 902-365-5044 if you want to join the group or you want to help out the group. Anyhow, in the town of Kempful, it's never been arts friendly. There's a lot of haters out there that hate artists and they don't want them to advance in life. You remember that old saying how some people won't tell you what's on their mind? but they don't want you to advance in life or get ahead a little bit. Well, that's what I was dealing with. I was dealing with those type of people at the town hall. These people didn't want me to advance in life, so I got discrimination and bullying for four years straight. So the moral of my story is we got to stop bullying and discrimination in 2018. This bullying and discrimination hurts the poor peoples of Kempful, like the yard sailors and the artists like Dennis Ramsey. So let's start a friendly art society in the town of Kempful, and I'll be the president of the group. You can call me at 902-365-5044. We can also make more videos for Facebook and YouTube and do some letter writing through communication and postage. So it'll be free to join. The only thing I ask is that you support the group with internet, Facebook, and YouTube, and we'll do our story of the fine artist, the folk artist, and the abstract artist. We'll support each other. You can call me at 902-365-5044. Also, please subscribe to my videos on the YouTube channel. There's art videos, singing videos, and talking videos. Anyhow, the idea is to make Kempful more arts friendly. That's my goal. Because when I suffered the bullying discrimination, I learned the hard way 
The Kempfold is not arts friendly. If anything, they're a bunch of hateful people at the town hall of Kempfold. And I had to learn the hard way. I had to get the four years of bullying and discrimination. And like I said before, if you've ever been bullied for four years straight, it's very painful, it's very hurtful, and it's maddening, maddening. Anyhow, getting back to starting a friendly arts society, that's my goal in 2018. You can call me at 902-365-5044 or write me a letter in that address I mentioned earlier. Also, the idea of it is to be more arts friendly, is support the fine artist, the abstract artist, and the folk artist. Anyhow, your help and support is truly appreciated. And you all have a nice day. Please write me a letter, Dennis Ramsey, 27 Canaan, C-A-N-A-A-N Avenue, Apartment B, Kempfel, Nova Scotia, Canada, Postcode is B4N2A7, Canada. Call me at 902-365-5044. I'd appreciate that. And if there's any millionaires out there, or rich folks that have disposable income, and want to donate some money to this folk art society, or art society, please do so. Um, the idea of it is to make it more arts friendly in the town of Kempfel. The reason I had to share my story of the bullying and discrimination is to let people know, even in a small town like Kempfel, people do suffer discrimination and bullying. Also, there's many stories on the internet about Dennis Ramsey's folk art painting. You can read the stories of discrimination and bullying that Dennis Ramsey suffered. I did the Chronicle Herald a few times, Frank's Magazine, and other newspapers also. Anyhow, getting back to starting a friendly art society in Kempfel, that's my goal for 2018. Let's make it more arts friendly for all the fine artists, the folk artists, and the abstract artists. You can call me at 902-365-5044. Also, please subscribe to all my videos on the YouTube channel. You all have a nice day, and take care. I also belong to the group Clan Ramsey. There's my patch. How do you like that? Clan Ramsey is a Scotland clan, and uh, my father, Robert Ramsey, uh, he was an old war veteran, Robert Ramsey, and we're related to William Wallace. We're related to all the Wallaces. Now, William Wallace, he was the most famous Scotland person. Now, William Wallace, they made the movie Braveheart. I don't know if you've ever seen that. Anyhow, Mel Gibson played William Wallace. Now, the Scottish people, the Ramseys, lived in the lowlands, and were related to the Wallaces. They fought against England when England tried to take over Scotland. Anyhow, poor William Wallace, he was executed in the end. It was a bad ending. Anyhow, you all have a nice day. Take care. And write me a letter, call me, or subscribe to my videos on the YouTube channel. You all have a nice day. Take care. And a wink for mom. But have a nice day. Bye for now. All the best.